afternoon everyone my name is my friend for those of you who don't know i do run a fashion blog called classically kept it does feature luxury contemporary and how to style if you are already subscribed thank you so much if not and you are into that go ahead and hit the subscribe button that way you will be notified every single time i upload a video so first let me go ahead and talk about this top and i know y'all are like it's summer maya why are you wearing this First of all, it's cold in this house. I'm always cold. And second of all, I just got this and I just cannot get over how beautiful it is. It is from Pixie Mart. I will link it down below if you're interested. I have my hair up just so you can see the full effect of this gorgeous neckline. But just to get into today's video, I'm a little excited about this one because it's a little different. So it is July 1st. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to talk about my June favorites. So let's go ahead and get started. Okay, so let's go ahead and get into the first item, and it is a pair of shoes. I know y'all have probably seen these before, but it is these from Senso. Absolutely adorable, absolutely gorgeous. I love the color. I bought them because of the ruching. I want to say they were like $115, but they are now on sale. I will go ahead and link them down below, and I'll go ahead and get the price for you. I'll probably put it up somewhere right here. But yes, I love these. I have worn them a couple of times. Um, for reference, I'm a size 6. Um, and they're just they're beautiful now I do start to I am starting to see like a little print or a toe print right here So what I'm gonna have to do is I'm probably gonna have to use some awesome and then I'll probably spray it with scotch guard That's my only issue with like light colored shoes because they tend to get so dirty And even though I try to be as delicate as possible, it never really works out But yes, I love these and they are leather too. That's a good thing. I love leather shoes the next, which I'm also very excited about, and I have worn these several times as well. We went to uh, brunch, and I, of course, we got the food to go, but it's these from Schultz. My nude, like y'all hear me say on my channel all the time, this is my nude, not, you know, the beige or the tan that when you walk into the store and they show you the nude section. But these, these are shoots, and what I love about these is they were 171, but now they're on sale for 85, and the entire shoe is leather. The top, the bottom, and the sole. Absolutely love these. And I didn't really realize, but this heel is actually quite high. I don't know if you guys can see that, um, which I typically wear anywhere from four to five inches anyway, but they just look like looking back at footage when I'm, you know, shooting and things like that, they just look really high, but they're really, really comfortable. And like I said before, I will link them down below. These are also a size six, okay? And then the next thing, the third thing, which y'all have seen this purse a hundred times, but I just love it so much, is the Colt Gaia EOS box bag. This is absolutely gorgeous. Now, I believe that this was, I want to say, $3.98, but my fiance got it on sale at Saks for like two something. And it opens like this, just like that. And then you put your stuff in it. Love this bag, and it's actually quite durable. I am a klutz, so I have dropped this several times, and nothing has happened. Um, nothing has bent, none of the balls have come off, this has not fallen off, and it does have the um, their logo or their moniker right here. But I absolutely love this bag. And actually, on my luxury wish list, which I will link up here, I wanted the pink one, but it's now sold out. So they do have another one. Um, I call it its cousin. It's kind of like the clutch version or kind of like a cross body, cross body version. And I'll put it right here, but I had to cross that one off of my list and now add that one. That one is $2.98, so it's a little bit better price. Now, as far as Colt Gaia is concerned, I absolutely love their aesthetic. They know how to dress a woman's body. Now, the stuff doesn't come cheap. I mean, you go on there and you will see a dress for like $1,000. The one that I want, I think, is about $6.58. They are having a sale, but their stuff sells out just so fast that you kind of have to be on their list and then when you get the email you kind of have to just go on the website and pick whatever it is you want just like I'm waiting on this dress from Zara it's an orange dress y'all have probably seen it before I'm on the wait list but I don't know if they're gonna get it back in okay but next we have this beauty it's from Banana Republic this puff sleeve and if you follow me on Instagram I'll link it right here um, you've probably seen this a hundred times as well. It doesn't have a zipper, so it does have the ruching in the back, but I absolutely love this top. And I'm not typically like a red girl, but it works with this top. And puff sleeves are so in right now. And I will say like the, the shirts that I have bought so far, or the shirts that I have bought, probably I'd say within the last two months, have been puff sleeve. 
and of course I will link this one down below Banana Republic is also having a sale okay and I've dropped the other one but this is a dress that I have been living in and if most of y'all know I was scheduled to get married May 24th then we had to postpone it to August 2nd Currently, um, North Carolina is in phase two, so it looks like it's going to be postponed again, which at that point, I just might have to, you know, go to the Justice of the Peace. Yes, I will go in my wedding dress and then have a, a big reception later. But if I had to go to the Justice of the Peace and I did not have a wedding dress, this is probably the dress that I would get married in. I absolutely love this dress. Polka dots are one of my favorite prints. And this dress is absolutely beautiful. Again, it's from Banana Republic. They did have it in red, but like I said before, I'm not really a red girl, and I gravitate more towards polka dots. So it does have a zipper on this side right here, and it does have the ruching in the back just to give you a little bit more of a cinched waist. And then right in here, it has like a little keyhole. And then let me, you can see right here a little bit, it does have the bigger polka dot. But yeah absolutely love this dress i get so many compliments every single time i wear it and it's just the little details that make this dress so special it is a handkerchief hem so that means that it is not even and then also on the sides right here where the straps are it has like a little fold right there but yeah absolutely love this dress it's so beautiful i think this probably encompasses my style 100 percent okay and then the next two, they're not really clothes, but I just decided to add them because I'm a little bit obsessed. So it's this one first. It's Champagne Toast. It's White Barn Scented Candle, and it smells absolutely delicious. Absolutely. And it is, I believe it is a soy candle, and I know those are supposed to be much better for you. And I've been trying to figure out where to get this from because I actually got this in a bridesmaids box. Um, one of my best friends is getting married. Of course, she asked me to be one of her bridesmaids, and I have just been really sniffing it um, whenever I can because it just smells so good. So I'll like put this on when I'm in my office working. Okay. And then the last thing, which is food. Um, I don't normally talk about food, but I have been obsessed with these chips forever. It's actually my fiance's fault. He was eating them one day and then I said, you know, let me try them. And actually what happened was he was like, they're gluten free. I said, okay, well, let me try them. It is these Ruffles baked cheddar and sour cream. Now these bags are really small, but when I tell you that I could probably go through this bag in one day, I could probably go through this bag in one day. Um, I bought these, what's today? Well, today is Wednesday, but I will be putting it up on Sunday. I bought these on Monday and they're almost gone. Now, the sodium content is 250 milligrams. That's a lot, but everything else that I basically eat is quite healthy. I've already named myself a salmonarian. Basically, all I eat is salmon. But yeah, I love these chips. You can get them from Harris Teeter, Publix, Walmart, Food Lion, really any grocery store. But yeah, I'm a little obsessed. I'll probably eat some once I finish this video. But, so that's one, two, three, four. Oh, no, wait. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So, yes, those are my favorites um, for June. It is now July. So, if you guys like this video, let me know, and I will do another one for July in August. But other than that, I do hang out on Instagram. I will link that down below. I do also have a blog. I will link that down below. Don't forget to subscribe, ladies, and thank you so much, and have a good day.